Hello, I'm Alice. Today, I'm going to walk you through the world of internet exchange points. We use them on a regular basis without even realizing. But what exactly are they? Let's find out together. Back in the day, exchanging information occurred by means of primitive techniques, even though some of them were less than successful. Over the centuries, luckily these methods progressed, allowing long-distance communication, which became faster and safer. But the real breakthrough came in 1971, when Ray Tomlinson, a brilliant beard with a man attached to it, invented an electronic post message, the email. Fancy that! A whole new communication system accessible to all on a global scale and on a daily basis. Guess what I'm talking about? The Internet. So what exactly is the Internet? Well, it's a network of networks, like a net that works. And its work is to be connected to a system of multiple networks via fibers. This huge network of fiber cables come together, plug into servers, then swap data with each other in buildings called data centers. Within some of these data centers, we find internet exchange points, sometimes called IXPs, IXs, or NAPs, network access points. You see, without a nearby IXP connection for your internet provider, it can cause slow and unstable service. Just think how many things can cause a connection to slow down. Bad weather, remote areas, configuration errors, traffic peaks during events, or even more unlikely problems. No solution? Wrong! If your internet provider is well connected and peers at IXPs, some of these problems can be avoided. But IXPs offer other kinds of benefits, such as a faster and more efficient experience. How? By avoiding intermediate steps and so bringing the user closer to data faster. Imagine sitting at home in a video conference with colleagues in the same city. Instead of connecting to just an ISP and then to another and another and another, just to reach a place close to you, with an IXP, ISPs connect over a shared platform and so your data will go straight to the final destination, allowing local content to stay local, reducing latency and speeding up data transfer. And not a minor matter, it reduces costs. There are times when you totally need a fast response, when you are trying to make money or negotiating an international deal, helping a lazy student, creating a computer with wheels, saving lives, chatting with friends, selling ice to Eskimos, looking forward to the latest series, searching new galaxies. Internet exchange points improve your experience wherever you are and at any given time. That's it. When an ISP connects to an IXP, it enables you, the end user, a better internet experience. Thank you and stay connected.